creating a bee-friendly city. If I had to describe it in three words, I would say sweet, sticky and tasty. So imagine if Welsh honey was a superfood. Professors and researchers at Cardiff University were looking into new antibiotics, the types of medicine that could tackle even the nastiest of superbugs you might find in hospitals, like MRSA. One of their lines of research was on the antibacterial properties of honey, which led them to discover a small back garden in Towin, North Wales. A man named Chris had been producing honey for fun in his back garden, and by pleasant coincidence, the honey his bees were producing was an antibacterial super honey. The researchers based in Cardiff were very excited by this discovery and putting on their thinking hats, wondered what gave this particular honey its super properties. Like humans, plants that bees feed off have individual DNA sequences, allowing scientists to identify the type of plant from the tiniest sample. Similar to a Jurassic Park movie, the scientists identified the pollen in the honey and tracked it back to certain plants found around Chris's house in North Wales. It was this specific pollen mix that gave the honey its super properties and therefore the researchers at Cardiff University came up with the idea of recreating Chris's back garden on a bigger scale back in Cardiff to see if they could mass produce this super antibacterial honey. And they started on the roof of the School of Pharmacy. They installed beehives on the roof and began planting the specific flowers identified in the super honey around the building. Their hope is to have beehives on lots of university buildings and to continue to plant the special plants across the university campus to create the first bee-friendly university in Wales. Through this effort, we will improve local biodiversity and provide food to the honeybees that already live in the city. But we don't want to stop there. The university is only a small part of Cardiff and so we are keen to engage with our neighbours and share our bee-friendly ideas with the rest of the city. Visiting schools and teaching children and teachers about honeybees is part of spreading the word. I'm hoping that schools will also want to have a beehive on site to give them a better understanding of how amazing the honeybee is, but also to produce a super honey of their own. Who would have thought that Wales would be the place where we discovered the next superfood? Cardiff University wants your help to spread the word about honeybees. Create a bee-friendly city and together we can improve the health of Wales and beyond. <laughs>